Hi everyone, this video will present about a project creating 16-bit magnitude converter by using PHDL design. Objective of this project is to understand the function, design and operation of digital converter. Learn practically how to compare two binary numbers by using the 16-bit magnitude comparator and applying practically PHDL code to design FPGA and CLPD device using Freeling IS 14.5 edition. Now, let us talk about the basic theory of comparator. Firstly, let considering A and B as input variable and C, D, and E output variable. Referring to this circuit, the comparator will take two numbers as input in binary form and determines whether one number is greater than, less than, or equal to the other number. As we know, comparator has two forms of condition, which is equality and inequality. Let's using this tool table to improve our understanding. The equality of comparator occur when all the pairs of primary digits of variable A and variable B is equal and equality, the output B will be high. While then, inequality of a comparator is conditioned when variable A have less input than B and also when variable A have higher input compared to variable B. Inequality case, the output is high, mean that when the input is different, the output for C and E will give high output. Now we go to VHDL. VHDL is a hardware description language used in electronic design automation to describe digital and mixed signal system such as field programmable gate arrays and integrated circuit. VHDL can also be used as a general purpose parallel programming language. We're going to start our design with library declaration. We use library IEEE, use IEE SPD logic 1164 all, use IEE SPD logic unsigned all. After doing the library declaration, we're going to write the entity and the architecture of design. The entity and the architecture of design are the two main basic programming structure in PHDM. Generally, the entity can be seen as the box view of the system like this. We give the system name, which is the entity name, and we define the input A and input B, then output GT and LP of the system which we need to interface. While that, the architecture is defined what is inside this box system. In architecture, we can use either behavioral or structure model to write our system in architecture. In PHDL, the entity can be having multiple architecture and in a combinational logic design, they also can have more than one entity. For example, in this project design, we have two entities in one design. Just like this, this is our first entity and this is our second entity. After we finish coding comparator component, we need a simulation program to test the logic design using simulation model to represent the logic circuit that interface design. The collection of simulation models called as the test bench. This is our test bench design. After complete all this coding, we are ready to generate our result. Our result can be in schematic circuit diagram and also in the waveform. And this is our result. Now we at the end of video. As conclusion, most digital comparator circuits are designed to accept multiple bits for comparison where in many applications the bits are combined by external software or hardware into actual numbers. At the heart of most central processing unit in a computer and other digital device, a comparator performs a large portion 
of logical operation that allow a computer to function. That's all for us today. Thank you for watching.